Beware of illegal video cassettes. Check whether this video cassette carries a genuine label hologram. Video piracy is a crime. Do not accept it. Demand a genuine cassette from your video store. Poor quality illegal video cassettes reduce your viewing pleasure and jeopardize future film production. When in doubt, telephone the Federation Against Copyright Theft or in the case of the Republic of Ireland When you rent or buy a video, you need to know that the film you choose is suitable for the audience at home. To help you understand what the film is like, you can look at the certificate it has been given. This film has been classified as 15. That means this film is unsuitable for anyone younger than 15. A film with a 15 certificate may have a fairly adult theme, or may contain scenes of violence, sex or drugs, which are unsuitable for younger teenagers. It may also contain sexual swear words. It is an offence to supply a video classified 15 to anyone below that age. Video certificates are there to give you the chance to make the right choice. Thanks for listening. Here are darling, four weddings. Here are Rocky, four, five, ten. Excuse me, I bought this video from you last Saturday. So? Well, I can't understand a word. Plane spotting, not surprised. I'm talking to Scott. Yeah, ain't they? No, I mean, it's the, so it's the sound. Yeah, it's hopeless. It's absolutely yeah. hopeless. Yeah, 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 no trains in it either. I suppose that's my fault as well. Here are, darling, 4 99 Well, the picture's rubbish as well. Well, that's your tracking, mate. Well, it's all right on my other videos. Ooh. Tracking's touchy. Be careful. Most pirate videos are unwatchable, and there's no comeback. Got a receipt, eh? Got a receipt? Look, you said last week. You said it's no good, mate. Oral contract. Not worth the paper it's printed on. Here are, darling, four weddings. Train spotting. As advertised on Crime Stoppers. Pirate videos, daylight robbery. The question is, have you seen it? Have you heard it? Have you felt it? Whoa! DVD. It's a movie on a disc the size of a CD. The picture is twice as sharp as VHS. The sound is so incredibly clear you can hear a pin drop. It looks and sounds like you're at the movies, but you can experience it at home. And let's not forget, you can watch it in widescreen. Pick your language. Choose from many additional features. Even watch a movie right on your computer. Whoa! And rent or buy thousands of DVD titles available from these great Hollywood studios. DVD. See it. Hear it. Feel it. DVD. I have long feared that my sins would return to visit me. And the cost is more than I can bear. A past he wanted to forget. I've been to war, and I have no desire to do so again. I have seven children. I do not wish to leave them fatherless. A family threatened by war. We have to do something. I forbid you to go! My child! You're my child! A son fighting for his beliefs. When I have a family of my own, I won't hide behind them. Hang him, put his body on display. Colonel, I beg you, by the rules of war. Would you like a lesson, sir, in the rules of war? Or perhaps your children will. No! Before this war is over, I'm going to kill you. Why wait? I'll come back. Might I request, sir, that you transfer my son here under my command? I'll fire first. Start with the officers. They don't know when or where they're going to strike. Where'd you learn all that riding, shooting? My father told me. How many were there? Maybe one. One man. Sounds more like a ghost than a man. This ghost. Bring him to me. This is not the conduct of a gentleman. I'll take that as a compliment.
he four fingers has a diamond the size of a fist. 86 carats. You know something that I've done? Jeez, it's flawless. Where? London. London. You know, fish, chips, cup of tea, Mary Poppins, London. What do I know about diamonds? I'm a boxing promoter. I've got a bare knuckle fight. I want to use the pie key. Bet your bags are there. Concentrate. Ah. Uh, what? I'm gonna have to repeat that. Bet your bags are there. Concentrate. You what? What is a gun doing in your trousers? For protection. Protection from what? The Germans. <laughs> Open the case and give me the stone. The only man who knew the combination. You just shot. In the quiet words of the Virgin Mary, come again. There is the stone. Heavy. Shut up and surround you, big bald. So what should I call you? You should call me Susan if it makes you happy. I don't care if it's Mohammed, Imad, Bruce Lee. You're going down in the fall. Shit. Bad boy yardies are supposed to know how to get rid of bodies. The best thing to do is feed them to pigs. You've got to starve the pigs for a few days, then the sight of a chopped up body will look like curry to a piss head. Anything to declare? Yeah, don't go to England. Uh, the salad sauce frame furniture and the scarf cushions with the mats and sack by Clover. Did you understand a single word of what he just said? My name is Sam Doniger, and this is my husband, Terry Doniger, and I'm a freelance documentary filmmaker. I'm doing a project on white high school kids who imitate black hip-hop life. Can you change who you are? If you're black, can you bleach? You're so young. If you're white, can you die? Hey, ask where you've been, Charlie. Hi, Daddy. I've been at the library. Oh, I've told you, if you must wear that ridiculous gold tooth, do it not in my house. Life is just crazy, man. Can you be ghetto without living in a ghetto? What do you think these white people really want from us? Trying to imitate us, trying to rap, trying to dress black. Can it be? All so simple. It ain't that because, simple. You know what I mean? Can you look within and embrace your soul or not? I'm here to sell records for you. If I do the video, it's gonna cross over. You're gonna make it look like it's Hollywood, even though it ain't yeah, Hollywood. Right. You're Dean, right? Yeah. Point guard on the writer team. I just wondering if you wanted to make uh, $50,000. I think they think they're gonna get some kind of life force. All right, I want to tell me what the crew can offer you. They offer us like safety. He offered me $50,000 to throw a game. Should I do it or not? Just be true to yourself. Is that Mike Tyson? Yeah, that's Mike Tyson. Yeah. I had a dream about you two weeks ago. I'm on parole, brother. Please. <laughs> Only dream you were holding me, that's all. Awesome. Oh, oh, sorry. You can look at me as long as you want. I thought I could trust you. What you is this? You can't trust me. What did I do? I didn't know that you knew these people. Why don't you get back downtown? Why don't you do that? I don't want to pretend anymore. Richard, I'm gay. Okay, Richard does not care. But I'll always be me and you always be you. I'm just trying to give you a reality check on how you're living right now. White people are different from each other as black people. What do you want me to kill a guy with myself tonight? I'll do it for you, no problem. You gonna do it? Yeah. You can't sell no child to do a man's job. Stay right there. Yo, yo, relax. Stay right there. See, 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 we playing our dreams. It ain't a game. We don't run game. We run businesses. Watch it shine and the world be our witnesses. I can do whatever I want. I'm a kid in America. Can I just introduce myself to you? In all honesty, I'm a fan. This I'm from a different culture. Want me I mean, to turn it off? This is not it's a study off. of animals. It's off. You've got beautiful eyes. Really? Yeah. Frederick John W. You are charged with the crimes of treason, terrorism, and unlawful procreation. Your sentence is life in the space prison fortress. There can be no escape. I wouldn't bet on that. He was the most valuable warrior in the resistance. But just when he thought his fight was over, the final battle Been waiting a long time for this. was just beginning. Now where you going? Someone has to turn off the lights. No pardon. We gotta seal the door! No parole. That's what I'm talking about! No escape. What the hell's he doing? Fortress 2. Re-entry. Just for the record, 
I ain't least bit happy about this. Morning, sir. Your team's in early today. Something special going on? Sorry, Ed. You know the rules. If we're gonna move forward, this is the next logical step. We're ready for you. Here goes nothing. Sebastian, are you in here? So, what's it like being a ghost? Ghosts are dead. I'm very much alive. The question is, what would you do if you knew you couldn't be seen? You trust your eyes. You rely on your senses. Sebastian, this is not funny. You think you're alone. Why did you have to go out in public? You have no idea what it's like. The power of it, the freedom. It's amazing what you can do when you don't have to look at yourself in the mirror anymore. But after he's got you... Tell us where you are. Sorry, Linda. You'll never be sure again. <laughs> this season... He could be here. He could be anywhere. There's more to fear... than you can see. You have no idea how much fun this is. Please adjust your universal translator to the language of your understanding. We will begin in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Of all the creatures in the universe, none possess the mating ritual as complex as the earthbound human. This one lacks the correct genetic stock. This one just smells funny. This one is just right. To prepare for mating, she sways her hips and flails her behind. Mating is imminent. The male's task is to determine if the female is ready. He will not give up, for the human male is among the horniest of creatures in the known universe. They move toward each other, and they brush lips. But her egg is not in her mouth, and his semen is not in his tongue. You said you haven't been with that many women. Yeah, but they were all sluts and drug addicts. Are you ready to take this relationship to the next step? The male's body tenses with anxiety. All his blood is rushed to his loins. Yes! <laughs> This condition will not pass until he has mated with his female. She is ready. He is ready. And at long last... Conception! The male is contented. The female is contented as well. Oh, good. Nervous about the male's reaction, the female tries to mate with her own pack. But that's a whole other movie. One can only feel for them a sense of admiration, for it is from these creatures that we have acquired the universal expression. Nice guys really do finish last. The mating habits of the earthbound human. <laughs> I'm an alien from another planet. Really? Yeah, somewhere way the hell out there. Somewhere, way the hell out there, lies a planet inhabited entirely by men. A planet facing extinction. Their only hope, to send an emissary to mate with a woman on Earth. The training will be extensive. Show your interest in the female when she speaks by repeating the phrase, uh-huh. I went to the store this morning. Uh -huh. The success of our planet's domination of the universe rests in your hands. Hi there. Hey. You're shaking. I thought we were going to crash. I like it when a woman shakes. Turns me on. What? I've got to have.
have sex, I have to have it right away. I'm getting that. Did you notice anything peculiar or unusual about him? There was this strange humming sound. What was that noise? It's coming out of your... From the front or the back? I'm making a noise. It hums. I guess it doesn't know the words. Well, I could teach it a few. It makes a noise like that water heater we had in that timeshare at Deer Valley. I'm not making this up, Nadine. Columbia Pictures presents... I want to have a child. I've never heard a man say that. A Mike Nichols film. I've actually decided I'm not going to have sex until I get married. Sorry? Marry her. Susan. What is your last name? Um, Hart. Susan Hart. Would you do me the honor of marrying me? But what kind of guy marries a chick after one date? Didn't you see the crying game? Gary Shandling, Annette Benning, Greg Kinnear, Ben Kingsley, Linda Fiorentino, and John Goodman. I'm tracking an alien. He's here to have sex with our women. Aliens having sex with people? How does that make me feel? What planet are you from? Well, you know, there's a lot of aliens. I hear they perform those anal probes. How primitive is that technology? Hello, we've come six trillion miles to study your... Ah! We're proctologists from space. <laughs> oh. Yeah, go ahead and rest. I'm begging you, don't kill me. I'm not gonna kill you, Arnie. Oh, thank you. Casper's gonna kill you. <laughs> One more job. You said that before. I need to know you're serious about leaving. I am serious. This is a bank robbery! Get out! You thought I was Cary Grant? Can we talk about this over a drink? Do you like whiskey or more? What is it with you two? I shouldn't trust it. You shouldn't? Half a million dollars? We don't have that sort of money. I'm talking pounds. We definitely don't have that sort of money. I want to know what Leo's up to. Not up to anything. You see about something? Bye, buddy girl. <laughs> Right, can I get paid now? <laughs> I'm gonna have to cut your dick off, I'm afraid, there. It's dangerous business we're in. You shot me, I shot you right back again. You made this mess, now you gotta clean it out. Lovely. Ah, oh, still friends. <laughs> Bye, Leo. Yeah, see you, Roscoe. You don't trust no one. Excitement has gone to me head now. You can't shoot me. Why not? Because if you shoot me, you've got to shoot Lily too. Oh, well, he's right. Ooh, I'm gonna get you, boy. Another one bites the dust. Ah. <laughs> Buster, we believe that everyone should be able to take home the film they want. That's why we promise to have more copies of the latest films than ever before, so you can take home any one of this week's new releases or rent it free next time. Blockbuster, bringing entertainment home. <laughs>